Call this uh, council meeting to Scottsburg in order. Uh, invitation <coughs> given by Mr. Gary Stewart and pledge given by Mr. Patrick Stewart. Mr. President, our Father in heaven, we thank you for this day. We thank you for the very many blessings that you've given us. We ask now that you watch over these proceedings and they'll be pleasing your sight. Please watch over the citizens, the employees, and all people from the United States and all over the world. Take care of them, watch over them, guard God and direct them. So we can, in the end, when they all come to be. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. <coughs> Ms. Phillips, will you call roll? Mr. Patrick Stewart? Here. Mr. Gary Stewart? Here. Mr. Smith? Here. Mr. Wallace? Here. Here. In your package, you have a copy of the agenda. Do I hear a motion to approve the agenda? I make a motion. Mr. Patrick Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Gary Stewart seconds all. <laughs> Any discussion? All in favor in the case of by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? You have a copy of your packet of previous minutes. I'll hear the, the uh, motion to approve previous minutes. I'll make a motion. Mr. Smith makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Patrick Stewart seconds. Any discussion? All in favor in the case of by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Being no old, no, no old business, we'll move to new business. Uh, first on the agenda is consider resolution 2017-5-21 surplus fire department equipment. I believe that's uh, an ice machine that is not operational. Is that true, Chief? That's correct. I'll hear a motion to approve the resolution to surplus fire department property. I'll make that motion. Mr. Patrick Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Smith seconds. Any discussion? Being none, we'll take a vote. All in favor indicate so by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Next on the agenda, we have considered budget amendment for the fire department in the amount of $10,697. <laughs> this is our portion of a, of a match um, for respirators, Chief. Yes, sir. Uh, breathing apparatus for the breathing. Uh, the matching fund, um, which the chief applied for, uh, he's receiving matching funds of two thousand or $213,943. Uh, our match uh, to that is $10,697. I'll hear a motion to approve the budget amendment for $10,697. Mr. Gary Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Patrick Stewart seconds. Is there any discussion? Being none, we'll take a vote. All in favor of the case of by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Third is a public hearing for alcohol license uh, for Ms. Uh, Ms. Patel. Um, doing business as Victory Spirits. Now is the time and place for a public hearing and the application for alcohol license. Uh, Ms. Patel, doing business as Victory Spirits. Ms. Uh, Ms. Phillips, will you share the particulars, please? The applicant is Jagisha Patel, top of license retail liquor for off-premise consumption, doing business as Victory Spirits, located at 3010A South Broad Street. There were no objections of businesses or residences surveyed. Nearest church and school footage requirements were met. License application is in order. Health, fire, and building inspections are pending. Final inspection and zoning verification complies. Thank you, Ms. Phillips. <coughs> is there anyone here in addition to the applicant that is in support of this application? Anyone in support? Is there anyone here opposed to this application? Anyone opposed? This concludes the public hearing for Ms. Patel doing business as Victory Spirits. I will hear a motion to approve 
this application. I make that motion. Mr. Patrick Stewart makes the motion. Is there a second? A second. Mr. Gary Stewart seconds. Is there any discussion? Being none, we'll take a vote. All in favor, indicate so by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Next, we have a public hearing and alcohol license application by Ms. Anita Baines doing business as Scooter Sports. Greer. Is Ms. Baines here? No, she's not, sir. I'm representing, I apologize for my appearance, but she's stuck in a traffic jam in 59. I was over here working, and she told me to come up here. <clears throat> so now it's the time and place for public hearing in the application of uh, Ms. Anita Baines on their business as Scooter Sports Grill. Uh, Ms. Ms. Uh, Phillips, will you share the particulars, please? The applicant is Anita Baines, Top of Lawson's Restaurant Retail Liquor, Class 1. Do business at Scooter Sports Grill, located at 3701 East Willow Street. There were no objections in the survey of businesses and residences. The nearest church and school footage requirements were met. Lawson's application is in order. Health, fire, and building inspections are pending final inspection. Zoning verification complies. Thank you, Ms. Phillips. Is uh, there anyone here in addition to the applicant's representative in support of this application? Anyone in support? Is there anyone here that's opposed to this application? Anyone opposed? Being none, this concludes the public hearing and the application for alcohol license by Ms. Anita Baines doing business at Scooter Sports Grill. I will hear a motion to approve this application. I make that motion. Mr. Patrick Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Gary Stewart seconds. Any discussion? Uh, what building is 3701 East Willow Street? Where's the building at? It's right, right across the street from Russell Tractor Equipment. Uh, Dry Creek? Yeah. Yes. Okay. <coughs> Any other discussion? Being none, we'll take a vote. All in favor, indicate so by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Next on the agenda is consider approval of engineering contract for Red Comp Pool Area HVAC. I believe you have a copy of that in your packet. This is for the engineering services. I'll hear a motion to approve the contract. I make that motion. Mr. Gary Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? A second. Mr. Patrick Stewart seconds. Any discussion? Being done, we'll take a vote. Ms. Butler, will you do a roll call? Purpose. <laughs> Boy, I know I wouldn't get away with it uh, without doing it. Mr. Patrick Stewart? Yes. Mr. Gary Stewart? Yes. Mr. Smann? Yes. Mr. Robbins, sir? Yes. Next, we have consider, uh, consider resolution 2017-5-22. Award Dozer bid for Sanitation Department. Mr. Blizzard, I believe this this is not coming out of general fund, right? This is out of an equipment fund that you have yes, for this right. purpose. Yes. Okay. And this is a, for a used dozer, correct? Yes, it is. Okay. Uh, that being said, I'll, I'll hear a motion to approve this resolution uh, to award Dozer bid for Sanitation Department to uh, Tractor and Equipment Company uh, with a bid of uh, one thousand or one hundred sixty-seven thousand dollars with a trade-in allowance of fifteen thousand for a total bid of one one hundred fifty-two thousand dollars. Mr. Smith makes the motion. Is there a second? Second. second. <laughs> Mr. Gary Stewart seconds. Any discussion? Being done, we'll take a vote. All of those in favor indicate so by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? We'll move to delegations being none. We'll move to reports. Mr. Mayor. Uh, just going to mention that the work on the square is continuing and going quite well. Uh, I think they're doing an outstanding, out, excuse me, <clears throat> outstanding job working with all the merchants and 
businesses there, and as you know, they're here at the corner and they're headed up towards Hammer. Uh, there was some concern about their big shoe sale coming up, but we, I think, got all that taken care of, so uh, it's going quite well. Uh, something you'll see coming up in the next couple of weeks, uh, RECCOM's going to announce flag football for this fall, co-ed. We're excited about that program. Uh, just, just another step of what we're trying to get accomplished. That's it right now. Thank you, Mr. Mayor. Mr. Stewart. Um, this past weekend, I was walking on the square. There was quite a few people that came up there and participated in it. Um, a few small businesses as well uh, participated. Um, of course, the Catfish Festival was going on. They didn't have the opportunity to go there. There was a lot of folks that came uh, by my booth that said they, they came to vote. So I think that was a win win for Scottsboro bringing a lot of people in. So hopefully, we can continue. Continue doing stuff like that, bring people in. Um, I know on the 17th of June is Summer Fest. Uh, they've been promoting that uh, a little bit here. So that's uh, something we'll look, look forward to then. That's all I have. Thank you, Mr. Gary Stewart. Um, just wanted to mention that uh, if you hadn't heard, the uh, Scottsboro High School softball team. They came in second in the state and lost the game the day of spring to 2-1, to one, but uh, very proud of these girls. These young ladies have really worked hard and I'm very proud of them. They only had two seniors on the team, so they're a bright future for them. But uh, they're, uh, they're really good kids and, uh, and we're really proud of them. So, other than that, I really don't have anything. Appreciate y'all coming. Thank you. Mr. Smith? I don't have anything. Well, I had an opportunity to attend the Catfish Festival and the, and the Market on the Square this weekend. I think it was, they were both well attended and uh, were enjoyable events. It wasn't very hot this, this weekend. Um, I've, I've had the opportunity, uh, I guess, the last 10 or 11 years uh, that I've been back in Scottsboro to, to have some level of communication with the Chamber. And, and I, I just like to say that, Rick, I, I think that you guys have uh, more momentum and uh, more passion than I've ever than I've ever seen you have uh, thus far, and I appreciate that. And, Mr. Elkins, I know that a lot of that comes from your your leadership and your vision, and, and I appreciate you. Um, that being said, I'll entertain a motion to close. Mr. Gary Stewart makes a motion. Is there a second? Second. Mr. Patrick Stewart, seconds. All in favor, indicate so by saying aye. Aye. We stand adjourned. <clears throat>